Hello, John. It is evaluation day. What a beautiful watch. Today's a day for beautiful 6139s, and this one certainly is nice. It's a late one, 1977, but gosh, it's in great condition. Uh, the unrestored. We can see the signal's a little messy, uh, but it's not terrible. Usual thing, some beat error, and it's out of adjustment, and it's a little ragged, but, I mean... The amplitudes are quite decent. Now, they're dropping and rising and dropping and rising. And this is about 40, 30 to 40 points low. 20, 30, 40 points low. And we're getting some big jumps and stuff. It definitely needs service. But physically, the movement's in very good condition. So, yes, it needs to be cleaned and the mainspring needs to be cleaned and it needs to be fully serviced and lubricated and everything. But once that's done, it should be great. Uh, it, the movement is beautiful. The watch never ever got water inside. You can see the brightness of the plates. See the bright shininess of them. Sort of the iridescent look here. It's just, it's really, really clean. I can see some of the remains of the original lubrication here around uh, the, the that column, vert, that, vert, that um, pillar wheel there. It does have a servicing mark inside from 1987. So, somebody took care of it. About 10 years on, it got a service. But it's, um, it's just, it's just magnificent. A little bit of haze on it. Would you focus? A little bit of haze on it, but... The winding bridge is clean. Plating, clean plating right to the edge of the plate here. It's not worn, so your winding bridge is not loosening up. What happens is the winding bridge bridges, they get loose over time, and then the weight starts grinding along the edge of these plates, but you're not showing that. Lower mainspring arbor port is tight. No, that's nice. The watch is complete. It's original. It's a runner. And the most important thing about a gold dialed 6139, look at the dial. Look at the dial on the hands of the dial is perfect. Isn't that amazing? It's just these these six these gold dialed 6139s, they uh, they have a tendency where if they are if they get if they're abused at all, they can have a tendency where the top clear coat lets oxygen start to come through in various places and the metal underneath turns this sort of dark chocolate brown almost black it's just sort of a it's just the way it is you can actually see a few teeny pecks around here that's because the clear coat pulls away from this sharp transition and you're more likely to start getting that oxygen coming through right here because it's very tight but i mean in the grand scheme this is really nice beautiful bright chronograph hands Indicator wheel turns as it should. That's a really nice watch. I think it's smooth sailing. Beautiful brushing. I think it's smooth sailing. Service. Case rebuild with seals. And... It's a flat top type 1 crystal. And it doesn't seem to have a mark on it. I wouldn't change the crystal for love or money. Just clean it up. Clean it up and service it. In case you rebuild with seals, move and service, and that should do her. Goodness, what a great watch. All right, you let me know. Thank you.